fellow learners today we shall be looking at systems of poultry keeping or systems which are used to keep our poultry uh, there are mainly four systems of keeping poultry or keeping birds we have the free range system or the open type system we have the deep litter system the cage system and the battery system we have the art fold or pin system uh, this is a free range system where the birds are left to roam around the garden or a specific area disadvantages of a free range system is that birds can easily get lost uh, the eggs they lay, birds can lay eggs in the wild and it is very difficult to find and collect them. Birds can easily be eaten by wild animals like kites, eagles, cats and others. Eggs can become dirty and they may fail to hatch. It is difficult to control diseases and pests and parasites among these among the birds on this type of poultry keeping uh, we have another type which uh, the fold arc or open system this is where a limited number of birds are kept in a small movable house called a pen an arc or a fold birds lay their eggs in the pens and they can be collected by the keeper these folds are movable from one place to another every day and the fold the fold is made of wood wire mesh uh, <coughs> and sticks are uh, bolted or tied together this is a view of how a pen or a fold looks like advantages of a pen system it is cheap to maintain compared to cage system or depleter system Manure is easily or even distributed on the farm since the pen can be moved from one place or another according to the desire of the keeper or the farm operator. Birds are easily restricted in movement. They don't move far away. Uh, birds can easily get vitamins and sunlight because the pen is open the pen system or the fold or the arc is open and can let light shine on the buds disadvantages of the pen system include it's more expensive than a free range system the folds can easily get old and break due to constant movements from one place to another buds are easily bored since there is no movement they are restricted to the to their folds or pins more land is needed to shift the folds from one place to another. Much labor is needed by the farmer to move the folds from one place to another on a daily. Uh, you can always pause the video and uh, check or write down those questions in the on the activity slide. Uh, another type of poultry, another type of system, another type of poultry keeping. Oh, another system of keeping poultry is the depleter system. This is where the birds are kept in a house throughout their entire life. The feeds and water are given to the birds inside the house. Litter is put on the floor to keep the birds warm among others. The house is well lit to allow the birds to feed constantly. Clean eggs are collected and this system can be used for all stages of birds, the, uh, the chicks, uh, the, 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 the old ones and the mid-sized birds. Uh, birds cannot get lost since they are, easy, they are well controlled in, a, in a, a house or a cage. This is an example or a view of the depleter system. Advantages of the deep litter system. The deep litter, the litter powered on the floor can be used as manure. Birds are protected from thieves and wild animals. E 
big wild cat. Many birds can be kept in a very small house. Uh, clean eggs are always collected. Birds cannot get lost. Uh, disadvantages of depleter system. It encourages vices, e.g. egg eating, cannibalism, top packing, and etc. Litter can be a fire hazard can easily catch fire that wooden cage. It is more expensive than a free range system. Uh, it requires a lot of materials to start. The litter can harbor pests and parasites. This litter later can host pests and parasites which may affect our birds. Components of the litter or what the litter is made of it is made of coffee husks, wood shavings, rice husks, crushed maize cubs, and sawdust. Importance of the litter is to provide warmth for the birds, prevent the eggs from breaking as they are laid. Litter provides heat that kills parasites, stroke germs. Litter got from the house can be used as manure by crop farmers. Disadvantages of a litter, like we said, it harbors parasites, it is a fire hazard, it can easily catch fire. The battery cage system, which is another system of keeping poultry. In this system, birds are kept in separate cages. It is not locally, it is not commonly used locally in Uganda. Each stage has one or two birds put outside the cages. This enables people to feed the birds easily and reduce contamination of its by by the birds themselves. Cages can also be constructed in rows, one above the other. The cage should have a good ventilation. This is a pictorial view of the system showing how birds feed and how eggs are collected. Advantages of the battery system, diseases in birds are easily are easy to identify or are easily identified. It is easy to identify a bird that does not lay eggs. Birds are very easy to control. They are protected from thieves and wild animals as compared to other systems of poultry keeping. Farmers can easily get manure. Manure is easily collected. There is there are there are easeless poultry vices in the battery system. Uh, disadvantages of the battery system, it requires a lot of financial support to start up. Birds do not eat whenever they need. Birds need much attention and care. Poultry diseases. Poultry diseases include coccidiosis, Newcastle disease, poultry typhoid, foul pox, foul typhoid, foul pox, gambo diseases, avian leukosis, salmonosis, and worms. Uh, diseases caused by a virus, a virus include Newcastle disease, foul pox, and gambo disease. Coccidiosis. Coccidiosis is caused by a protozoa and signs of coccidiosis in birds include ruffled feathers, yellowish and white diarrhea, cheeks are thin and not lively, blood, stain, blood stained droppings, cheeks crowd together, dullness and drooping of wings. Prevention of coccidiosis in our poultry Put drugs in food and water for the birds. Sh should keep all the feeding troughs clean. Isolate or kill infected birds. Keep the brooder and areas around clean, most especially the feeders and drinkers of the poultry. Newcastle disease. It is also caused by a virus, and signs of Newcastle disease in the poultry include difficulty in breathing, coughing, sneezing, and rattling. 
lameness sometimes several birds suddenly die greenish yellow droppings birds twist their necks staggering and dropping off wings uh, prevention and treatment and control of Newcastle disease this effect the poultry house regularly vaccinate the birds after every six months in case of outbreak the flock should be killed there is no treatment for Newcastle disease but prevention is possible uh, another disease is foul pox it is caused by a virus and signs include difficulty in breathing egg production and fertility in our poultry reduces water reservoirs on the comb water and around the eyes discharge from the nostril and eyes molting and shedding of feathers ulcers or wounds in the mouth uh, prevention and treatment of foul pox vaccinating the birds maintaining perfect hygiene killing and burning the infected birds disinfecting the poultry house regularly and lastly we shall look at foul typhoid foul typhoid is called is caused by a foul typhoid is caused by a bacteria called salmonella this salmonella bacteria can attack humans as well and therefore dangerous for people to eat raw eggs signs of foul typhoid include ruffled feathers and pole on ruffled feathers and a poly water folding their heads close to the body water greenish yellow droppings the liver kidneys and spleen may become enlarged control and prevention of foul typhoid vaccinating the birds at a stage of five weeks revaccinating at four months killing and burning infected birds no specific treatment for foul typhoid has been indicated so far uh, sorry i think this is the last one uh, i thought uh, foul pox or foul typhoid was the last one but i am forgetting we also have gambro diseases it is caused by a virus too and signs include ruffled feathers dropping of the wings diarrhea and later blood stained droppings chicks die in a very short time uh, poultry parasites parasites are living organisms that depend on its host for food and shelter and harms it uh, parasites are of two types endo and ectoparasites examples of ectoparasites include lice uh, red mites fleas and depleting mites signs of worms in uh, poultry white choke droppings watery diarrhea fewer eggs laid uh, control of worms in poultry deworming at six weeks and every month uh, control of ectoparasites dusting laying nests with uh, insect sites ensure good hygiene in the poultry house dusting birds with disinfectants and uh, dipping the birds feet in kerosene to kill the fleas uh, poultry vices in the poultry house Poultry vices are bad habits in the poultry. Examples of common poultry, poultry vices in the poultry house include cannibalism, egg eating, feather pecking, bullying, toe and skin pecking. Causes of vices in the poultry is boredom, starvation, little or no food to the poultry birds, overcrowding of poultry, lack of a balanced diety signs of poultry vices among poultry birds blood stained beaks or bills bleeding and the vent yellow stains of egg yolk on the beak are uh, broken eggshells in the poultry house fighting among us are poultry how to control these vices are uh, debaking birds debaking the birds that eat eggs 
avoiding overcrowding the birds, give the poultry the boat feed. Give the poultry birds feeds rich in calcium. Cull or isolate the birds that are aggressive, hang greens in the poultry or other materials to keep the birds busy. Provide proper nestling for layers. Collect laid eggs as soon as they are laid and regularly. Remove broken eggshells from the house and provide enough feeds to the birds. Uh, record keeping on a poultry farm Types of records kept on a poultry farm include flock records which shows the number of birds on the farm, healthy records which shows the treatment given to the birds, production records shows the production percentage and rate and the number of eggs collected daily, feeding records shows the type of feeds, quantity and the schedule or an amount consumed or wasted. Uh, sales and expenditure shows the expenditure and income from the feeds, eggs, sales and sales of birds among others. Importance of keeping records on a farm helps to plan for the future of the farm, to know the profit or losses made on the farm, for fair tax assessment uh, by tax bodies, enable the farmer to get loans, to know the progress of the farm, enables the farm to review the history of the farm. Uh, below are the topical questions relating systems of poultry keeping. Thank you for watching ShareBeat Uganda. Thank you for supporting us. Uh, if you enjoyed and like or oh, and like sorry if you enjoyed and learned something from this video please push the channel by giving us a like and subscribing to the channel to the channel if you're not subscribed. Thank you. God bless you.